Hey guys, it's Derek there of Dragon, and we got a, another Chrono today. This one's of the new SRC XM8. There have been rumors going around that this thing fires at 320 feet per second. The reason? Because instead of using metal bushings, it uses ball bearings. Which is, if you don't know, puts a lot less stress on the gears, makes it a lot easier for them to just simply just pull. And overall, it's just so much better for the gun, and the performance just skyrockets. So we're going to be doing a chrono of the SRC XM8. This is, should be generation three now. So see what it can do. All right, so here's the chrono. First thing will be feet per second. Let's see it. 326. 322. 323. 313, and I just managed to somehow hit my brand new HD camera. 318, 319. So the rumors are true. It does fire at 320 feet per second with one that went up to 330 almost. All right, so as I promised, I will be shooting a can with every single chrono. And please keep in mind that this battery is almost dead. So the rate of fire is going to be slightly slow when I put it on full auto. Uh, this gun actually does fire, have a very high rate of fire. So with that being said, first time automatic, then full auto, let's kill a can. All right, so if you're somewhat blind and couldn't see that, that pretty much killed it. All right, so this gun is, the rumors are true, it is actually a lot stronger than before. Uh, the externals are a lot tougher. It can handle a lot more. Overall, it's a better deal getting a Generation 3 than one of the earlier generations. So, that is Red Dragon Airsoft's Chrono. Oh, yes, and all of this Chrono, everything was done with P-Force .2 gram BBs, .20. Nothing more. Nothing less. .20. So... Alright, that was Red Dragon Airsoft's Chrono of the SRC XM8 Generation 3.